One Christmas morning, I woke up stark naked in our shoe cupboard, clutching nothing but two cans of fake snow. <laughs> Lee Mac, what do you make of that? So, what, yeah, what year was this? About 1993. OK, and can you talk us through how this happened? I uh, went to bed very drunk on Christmas Eve. Actually, it was Christmas morning by then, about two in the morning. And I woke up again uh, in the cupboard under the stairs, <laughs> totally naked, uh, with two, as I realised when I picked them up, empty artificial snow spray cans in each hand. And the light was on, and my face was in the Wellington boots. <laughs> what had you gone in there for? I'd gone in to put the snow cans back after what I then realised I'd done with them. What had what you, you done, done with them? them? <laughs> Two weeks earlier, we'd bought our family Christmas tree in the hall, and Judy and Chloe, my daughter, decided that it wouldn't be a good idea to put artificial snow on it, and Jack, my son, and I thought it would. And we had a massive row, and, of course, the ladies won. So the spray was hidden at the back of the cupboard, but I saw where Judy hid it. Okay. But you did this naked. Yes. I, I did it in my sleep. Can I just stop you there? No yeah. one's listening now. We're all just thinking, oh, <laughs> Richard Maidley sleeps naked. <laughs> And, uh, and clearly, I mean, I can only su suppose what happened. I'd gone downstairs in my sleep, taken the cans out, covered the tree with, uh, with fake foam, put, gone back in the thing, and then woken up. You'd done the whole tree? The whole was it a good job? <laughs> it was terrible. I mean, it, it covered everything. It covered the lights, it covered the baubles, it covered... <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was like a great big Mr Whippy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm intrigued by this uh, cupboard under the stairs, Richard. Oh, I think someone with your income would, by now, or by 1993 even, mm -hmm. during your, let's call it heyday, would have had... <laughs> I do think you would have had it converted into a, into a, a downstairs uh, facility. Is that no. your view of opulence? <laughs> <laughs> that, that any sort of space under stairs must be fitted for immediate <laughs> Any sort of ingestion. unused space anywhere. Any money at all. <laughs> there's, just, there's something about the combination of wealth, career success and a little cubbyhole <laughs> that just says poo. <laughs> What did Judy and Chloe have to say about this in the morning? Christmas morning dawned and I went down with Judy and there it was, it's looking awful. And I just went... Jack, <laughs> we told you not to do that. And you went and kept it up for about a minute and then confessed. So you, you woke up at two in the morning? I didn't wake up. I was sleep spraying. You were sleep like. spraying, but yeah. then you went, in, you went into... a horrid connotation. <laughs> Think of the children. <laughs> you went, so We've you, all done you it. You did the spray. <laughs> What's your first conscious memory? Waking up in the cupboard or waking up in the bed? No, waking up in the cupboard. Do you always sleep naked? Yes. Always. Yeah. How does Judy feel about, about that? <laughs> well, so does she. Blimey. Is it me or is it getting up to the... <laughs> Sorry, hang on, hang on, hang on, oh, hang on, hang on. Oh, come, come, no, 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 give me a minute. <laughs> Hands up, who sleeps naked? David, keep your hands down. <laughs> That's got to be 40%. No, I mean, obviously, I go to bed dressed as Scrooge. <laughs> so what are you thinking, Lee? I definitely think it's plausible. What do you think, Kate? I'm, I, what concerns me is the gap between the waking up at 2 o'clock in the morning and going to bed and not sort of doing anything about the tree... Just leaving it. Just leaving it. Miles, I think it is true. You do. So what are you going to say? <clears throat> OK, split decision. We will go with... I will go with Miles and say that's true. You're saying it's true? Richard Maidley, were you telling the truth or were you telling a lie? I have to tell you guys, you've made a terrible start. For us, it's true. <laughs> <laughs> uh...